everyone, so my name is Angela J. Fernanda Midara. So for today, I'm going to show you, demonstrate to you about a very important and very useful non-digital instructional material. So we call this as a conventional instructional material. These are non-digital. So the chosen instructional material that I will be showcasing for you today is the rope and pole display board. So as you all know, the rope and pole display board is as a very important non-digital instructional material for teaching. It provides learning to students. You can create various various learning materials with this kind of equipment. So the materials we're going to use are, first and foremost, we're going to use flashcards. So my chosen topic is all about planets. So these are flashcards regarding about planets. So as you can see, these are Pushkas guarding about planet. So, and we're going to use sound clips. So, it's very important when we're using, when we're doing a robot pole, dis pole display board, we're going to use these clips. You can either use this kind of clips or the Instagrammable kind of clips. So, so, so tiny clips. And you can also use your scissors. And instead of using the conventional rope, I'm going to elevate it by using series of lights is our ropes so this is our ropes a series of lights so so are you with me so let's start making a rope and pole display okay so as you can see so the first thing we need to do in creating our rope and pole display board is to prepare our two poles and establish the ropes so as you can see here in my back we already put the ropes which is our series of lights in these two poles here behind me so these are the two poles that we're going to use you can also use your blackboard when you're placing your ropes or you can also use different kinds of materials when you're creating your poles so in my case i will be using the already built wood here in this in my back so let's start with putting our Thank <laughs> you. 